I'm sorry it's a dark day today and it's foggy and I have to be up at like 6 a.m. because I have stuff for work, but I am getting so excited. I'm meeting with like multiple clients today for the IT stuff and I've literally done it on such a low budget. Like, okay, I wanna explain something because a lot of times we have a hard time starting businesses um, because they're so expensive off the start. But I think that there are ways to mitigate that and work around it and be kind of creative in terms of not spending a crazy amount of money. And one of the things that I figured out is that with like this business, I started the eBay stuff to be able to fund it, right? And I've been able to, you know, get about a thousand dollars to start with. And the only thing I was really funding for were a couple tools and stuff. But for the most part, like it's just experience having a couple, having a good bit of like tools to open up laptops, to work on screens um, and working from there. And now like I have like four or five people I can work with. I'm actually meeting someone at my lunch hour today to work on a small business um, and see if I can get them to, some help with their internet. They're having some problems um, and starting a new project there. I've like replaced screens. I've um, been working on slow systems. I've been working on viruses. And this is all started in only a few weeks. And the main thing is that I don't really spend a lot of money. Like I have a Craigslist ad, which I'm probably gonna take down soon because Craigslist is a little sketch. So I don't do that too much, but it's five bucks for it. Um, and I do Thumbtack and I only, I spend about 20 bucks a week to get uh, leads and stuff. Um, and they give me a lot of free leads too cause, since I'm just starting. So I, I typically just roll off the free leads. I go to a couple different websites. Like um, I tried like TaskRabbit and things like that, but they don't work in my area. But I think those things are possible for you if you're interested in something like this. And basically to explain it all, I'm doing like tech services. So anything tech related because I've learned all this stuff over the course of 10 years really. I went to school for it. I went to jobs for it. I've um, worked there in high school and worked on computers. So I just try and help people as much as I can. Um, I let them know like with the Wi-Fi adapters or um, how to set up a network in their house, all that stuff. And so it's been really exciting because now I have about five or six people, I think it's at four or five, but it's actually five or six that I'm gonna be working with, replacing screens, um, you know, making sure that things are put into place. I give them advice. Uh, I've gotten paid to give advice. I, I didn't think that would happen, but um, I would help people over the phone and they would pay me for helping them. And it's some of, one of those things that I've never thought could happen. Like. Right now, from this work, I've made about $500 and I've just started, so, and I still have a lot of jobs left that I need to complete. Um, so I'm really proud of that, and it's one of those things where you can do it on a low budget, it can happen, it just takes a little bit of creativity. I use, you know, I try to figure out word of mouth, I talk to small businesses, I've actually been emailing them, like cold emailing people with like basically a laundry, laundry list of the things that I can do that will benefit them. And that has worked in one situation because I'm talking to the small business guy today. Um, but, you know, just going out on a limb and trying that type of stuff really does help because you never know who's gonna respond. You never know who actually needs something. And so that's one of those things that as time goes on, I think I'm not gonna take for granted. I'm gonna make sure that I give every single person a good opportunity to be able to get something to be able to let me know what their problem is I don't shoot people down I do let them know though if there's something that I cannot do and that's one thing that I've always made sure to do just be transparent and a lot of people need the help because these places like these computer places and these other places they charge so much for things like screens and electronics and it's it's crazy so the more that we that I'm work on it I think the better it will get I'm really excited <sighs> we'll keep going till then see you tomorrow